And welcome back to Alan Wake. Last time, we got introduced to his world. Now crazy it's going to be here in the world of Alan Wake. This time, we're going to finally come to Divers Island to the cat, to the, uh... Yeah. So, there are still two collectibles here on the island, which we will grab over your first focus. I can't sprint for some reason, you know. Bird leg cabin. On Divers Island. So we're gonna go ahead and open the lock here. Spam A for no reason. It's dark in there. We need light. Can you figure out how to get the power on, honey? Hello? You need Can all 14. Just radio settings. Radio is refined. No we'll see if we can rope them into an interview later on. Now let's uh, go to the phones, caller. You're on KBF FM. Hi, Pat. It's Rose. Why, well, hello, Rose. What's on your mind? I know who that famous artist was. It was Alan Wake, wasn't it? Uh. He's my favorite writer. Well, Rose, I... I just saw him at the diner. Oh, I am so excited he's here. I'm sure he's glad to be here, too. Well, folks, I guess the secret's out. This is Pat Main on KBF FM. And now, some music. Great. So much for keeping a low profile. And, of course, the rule, the rule is we run for music. Um... Did I already grab it during my practice? Freak, I'm dumb. It would be... Yep, it would be right here, because I already have six from the last episode. Yep. From here on out, I will be pointing out everything else. Sorry about that. Death recordings, you know. What am I doing? I know where I need to go. Cable goes to that shed over there. Yep. And then here you said the last time I played this. An old generator had been connected to the power cable. Who's ready for Dead by Daylight? Fun joke, right? Okay, I'll look around a bit. The island sure had once been the Come site on. for a love story. Maybe it would be that again. <laughs> it was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. I thought we could be happy here. Well, we have that going for us. Let's go see Alice. Alice? Honey? Alan, I'm upstairs. I have a surprise for you. Well, hello. Well, hello there. <laughs> I'm not the surprise. It's in the study. Go take a look. <laughs> okay. Do you get the surprise? Uh. Surprise! Alice? What is this? I guess I have a small confession to make. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past- Dad, Alice, you- Everyone Hey, keeps... hey, hey! Just hear me out! There's a local doctor, Dr. Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. Maybe so now you want to get me committed? No! It's not like that! That's not- Alan? Alan? I don't, just don't. I don't want to hear it. God damn it, Alice. God damn it. I knew she wouldn't follow me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. Oh. Alice! Alice! 
had gone dark. All the lights were out. Uh What has happened? I don't know if I said words in a while. What? Hold up. All right. All the lights were out. Let's try this again. And not jump in the water. Alice, I'm coming. It's all right. I'm coming. No! What the hell? You need to burn birds for an achievement, too, which I didn't do the last playthrough. No. <gasps> See, he just died of swimming. So, what is he doing? Waking up in the crashed car felt like I had woken from one nightmare and entered another. I couldn't remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. Alright. There's nothing we are going to do for a book. The Creator's Dilemma. By a Dr. Emil Hartman. Seeing the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like it. And I didn't like the guy's smug face on the cover either. The gas station was my best bet. They'd have a phone I could use. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. I am starting to remember this game again, though. Because it's been, like I said, it's been almost 10 years since I've played this game last, so. Damn. Rip car. I don't really have anything, so I'll just run to the gas station. Hello? Hello? Someone there? The loose sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night. Hmm, that sounds familiar. Departure by Alan Wake. Hmm, nice. We had that nightmare for some of these, the man but... turned to face me. His face was covered in shadows. It was hard to make him out in the darkness of the forest that surrounded us, but the axe he lifted was plain to see. It glistened with the blood of his victim. He grinned madly. The shadows were alive, distorting his features. It was a scene from a nightmare, but I was awake. I don't think I'll actually read through all these because there's a hundred and four of them in the game. So we'll make things easy. Anybody there? Please. I've been in an accident. It's a weird looking guy. Hey, check what I can jump in the water now. The lights up ahead were a good sign. Maybe I wouldn't have to hike all the way down to the gas station to find a phone. A little doubtful. <laughs> I 
a second. Anybody there? Please, I've been in an accident. Hey! Hey, you! Phil! There's been an accident. I need help. Listen, Deposit. I need to... Premium cabins for rent in... Whiteful! Oh, hell. Carl Stucky. Please, to meet you. non refundable reservation deposit required. Hmm. Fair and square. <laughs> That's a little weird. Oh, okay. Should be right here. Yep. We got a copy of the thermos and a manuscript page. Good time. there for a little bit. I'm gonna go in here. I had to figure a way out of this. Any second now and Stucky would be knocking on the door with his axe like Nicholson in The Shining. Mm -hmm. Energizer. During your... Trying It's the latest thing. In Testimony. Yes. Roman. Uh, right Falls Sheriff you... Station. Oh, I... Hello? Hello? Um, you can see the sight and keep those cars. Kind of sucks. Fired a gun outside a shooting range, and now I just killed someone. Good job. Something. There were no bodies. They just disappeared. If I was dreaming, it felt real enough to make me sick. You see those errors, right? Eerie hand painted graffiti was revealed by my flashlight. Someone had hidden a chest of supplies near it. Flare guns OP after all. We gotta keep an eye on them. We need all of those as we can't get those. Ow. That was telling me. Ooh, button. That kind of hurt. The dark forest was the last place I wanted to go, but I had no choice. I had to get to the gas station. Okay, well, let's do it. That's right. 
hearts. No, it's not. I need more ammo. What do you got in here? And energizer battery, sweet. I appreciate that a lot. Oh, uh, the one thing I said we gotta be careful is we gotta figure out every possible place to look. Because you know, game logic. But I think that's it. Do I need to go down? question when I saw the river below something uncoiled itself oh. inside my head hmm. I realized that I'd have to find a way across I didn't even want to look at the water water bad Another coffee thermos. Sure, because I feel like there should be something else here, just because I feel like there's going to be a crap ton of stuff in this game we got to get. Where are you? Stucky was still out there, in the dark, stalking. I'm more worried that this. Uh, there should be something else here that I'm more worried about. Hmm. Hold on one second. Alright, sorry about that. Let's get to this. I just want my phone again. Oops. There it is. I figure, like, here's the problem, I feel like, there's so many collectibles in this game, that's going to be a challenge. So, we'll just keep moving for now. And I got to it's going to be hard to get everything, but we'll do it. Crazy river. Ooh, that hit me. I'm trying not to use my batteries as much. Caution. Hmm, I feel like. Actually, let's go ahead and go up. Uh, 
Let's see. Oh. Up here? Taken. They're taken. What's taken? That's what they're called. Well, I think that that like we'll probably end up doing. Two playthroughs of this game, just uh. Get an Eric 12 battery today. Oh, we'll just jump off. If we can. Who's gonna stop us? The staircase was broken. I had to make my way up some other way. Well, that's always good. There was no power. There was bound to be a generator somewhere at the logging site. Well, hold on. I couldn't stay here. There had to be a way to get up there. I see stairs, but... Oh, hi, Thermos. Beautiful. With all this forestry equipment around, there had to be something I could use to reach the top. Oh, see a generator. Let's do that. Shouldn't be afraid to use batteries. We need to use a hundred of them in this playthrough anyway, so. Dead by daylight time! Anything in the small shed? I thought this would be a good place to put some like manuscript pages. Head back. Well, this is green now, so we should be able to use it. That looks good enough.
Ooh, cans. Remember those? Make sure you always shoot those. If you can buy them. There's a radio right there, huh? Well, I was just outside for a breath of fresh air, and what a night, eh? I know most of you are probably in your beds by now, but if you're still up and around, take a moment. Step outside for a spell and breathe in deep. Mm, the weather is absolutely still. The sky is crystal clear. It's like the forest is quietly breathing along with you. Do you listen? No, I'm, I'm a night owl, and it's on nights like this I wish I wasn't cooped up in the studio. Uh, makes an old man like me wish I could just roam wild. But here I am, and it would keep you company all night long if I weren't. Uh, it looks like uh, I'm not the only one staying up late. Caller, you're on the air. Hey, Pat, it's Maurice Horton. Hello, Maurice. What are you up to? Well, I was just taking Toby on his walk. Oh, isn't it beautiful out there? Sure, but Pat, the reason I called is that Toby heard something rustling in the undergrowth and took off after it, and I couldn't find it. Probably a rabbit. Sure. Toby loves rabbits. Well, sure. And Toby's a friendly dog? Oh, Toby loves people. Usually he comes back, but we, we were pretty far from home, and it sounds like he went pretty wild there. Great dog, but his cup for his own good. <laughs> well, Maurice, it's out there now. Hope Toby comes home soon. Yeah, thanks, Pat. You have a good night now. Huh. Hey, what's that? Ah, I like these. That's it? It's the flare gun? Uh, I'm kind of worried about that one, game. Ow. I keep running to my microphone. I need to fix it. Oh, I gotta run for the music. I gotta run for the music. Hey, manuscript page. That's kind of easy. The gas station was closer now. It's light welcoming in the darkness. Oh. Oh no. It's the famous dog is Hmm. Oh, freak's another guy? Oh, freak. Well, I'll just use those. That works out. Alright, we've reached this checkpoint, a safe haven. So, guys, let's take a break. Next time on, uh, Island Wake, we continue our quest.